watching another Sunny Fortnightly News. We have a brand new ministry on base and it's called Homes for Hope. Are you wondering what that means? Well, let's check it out. See, my background is construction and God's actually given me a job to do to bring His kingdom here on earth by doing construction for people that are poor. I'm so excited about it. It's like when you have a friend that knows the favorite drink that you have and they give it to you and you just feel so blessed and so valued. But what God's given me is my future, my future plans, my calling with this Homes of Hope. Essentially, we'll go out, build homes for poor people, and show them the love of God. It's a great way to come and help in a practical way to serve the kingdom of God and to really see His kingdom come here on earth. So if you'd like to join, let me know. I'd love to have you. This January quarter, we've had several schools running and it's already past the six week mark. Time flies so fast. Let's check out some of the testimonies from the students from these last six weeks. Yeah, I think what I've learned from the past six super challenging but really insightful weeks of teaching is just um, that we are learning how to be in relationship with someone, not something. And it's, I've learned from uh, the teaching from our community and it's helped me to see that it's so, it's such a dynamic relationship. It's not stale. It's, um, being with the Lord, sitting and asking Him questions and giving Him time to speak and to listen, um, conversations and knowing the things about Him, uh, applying what we learn from teaching and really digging into the Word, um, but also just taking time to talk with Him. He's the first thing to Now, do you remember the collaboration we were talking about called Surge? Well, we had a whole Thursday night meeting focused on the area of celebration. We had bands, we had art displayed. It was so beautiful. The night was filled with international expression, displaying art pieces, dynamic music performances, including Della Fern, as well as our School of Music and Missions. Some of the art was still in the stages of being created, which invited people to be a part of that process. There was also an invitation to dance to music where people really enjoyed themselves. As we are usually stationed in Perth, we are also out in the nations every quarter. We have a team in South Africa that we have some footage to show you. Your children, a written love on our hearts, your blood flows through us. We are orphans no longer. It's really great to see that update. That's it for this fortnight. Don't forget to ask questions on our YouTube channel and subscribe. Follow us on Twitter and like us on Facebook. That's it for now. See you later.